Hey guys, what's up, you boy, Wimbledron, back out of another video, and in today's video, we are back with the Battle Pass. Last time, we took a look at, Sp not Spider-Gwen, Gwenpool. I keep getting that wrong, so I do greatly apologize if, for the people who are potentially going to flame me in multiple comment sections. But, last time we took a look at Gwen, along with Gwen's uh, other style here. This time, though, we have War Machine, which, specifically, we will be taking a look at... Handheld Missile, the Machine of War, the Warforged Wings, the Mother of All Black Wings, instead of Mother of All Bombs, the War Machine Outfit, along with the Iron Patriot colour scheme for the items, at least for what we have. So, if you liked this, hit like button, share, comment, and subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys know when I go live and when I upload all that good stuff, and yeah, with our further ado, let's go into creative mode and take a look at... Uh, War Machine slash Iron Patriot in all of their glory. Let's go. So before we before we take a look at um, Iron Patriot slash War Machine in all of his glory, we first should take a look at his wings. Which, dear God Almighty, these are the best wings we have ever been gotten or been given. Like I'm expect I was full on expecting this just to be like an overhead like hold on to glider which I'm so glad they actually gave him them as actual wings like obviously they've got like the thr thrusters there in the middle and like the big ass wings with like the sign insignias on them with like the missiles underneath as well which just from above you can see how that looks and from below obviously the moon there as well um, but overall some of the best wings I think we've ever been given obviously when you kind of fly or not it kind of like tucks the wings in to an extent just to give more aerodynamic or something I don't know but overall it is such an awesome glider um, yeah let's go take a look at War Machine himself to then take a look at Iron Patriot let's go so here we have War Machine in all of his glory which I do have to say pretty cool skin Still haven't decided if I like him with the helmet on or without the helmet on. It's kind of a sexy one to me. I think for his Iron Patriot style, his helmet looks better just, you know, with colour scheme and everything. This just looks better to me because I remember seeing Rhodey's face more in this style of armour than his red, white and blue one. But anyway, take a look at Rhodey in all of his glory. You can see his face. Isn't quite like Don Cheadle. Um, kind of look at a bit more like Maximus from... I do believe it's Maximus. You call him from the Volley TV show. Not that that's a bad thing by any means, but it's just an observation. You can see his arc reactor side of the thing is red, the way it always is, with the little lights and whatnot. You can see it on his arms there as well, and there's little blaster looking things. On his shoulder, he has like the old pods and stuff. That's just got 12k XP, very nice. But he's got like the little missile pods, he's got like his big Gatling gun doodad as well. On his back you can see he has the mother of all bombs, or the mother of all backblings in this case. Which is just a, a, the equivalent of a fat man, but with a giant red blinking light on top of it. Which, it doesn't look that bad. He has the little like, symbol there on both of his shoulders. Which is also what my uh, banner icon is at the minute. If you might have seen it in the intro. His pickaxe you can see is literally a missile. Um, with the little red like swoosh coming from the bottom. Or the thrust coming from the bottom. Which when you swing it. It swings like a baseball bat. Which I'm not the biggest fan of. But still it is what it is. And then you see the rest of the outfit here. In all of the glory. Just looks like War Machine. I really do like it. So yeah. We only have the gun wrap to take a look at. There is no emote or anything with them. But you can see the emote, or the gun wrap even, is very simplistic. You can see just that red bit sort of charges up and depletes. Which, when you shoot it, it just flags up or flashes red. As if it's like fully charged. And then it just like does its thing again. Which, if you take a look at the SMGs here, you can see also how they look. They've got the little tiny bar at the front with the like American star and 
wings thing there as well. Which, if you shoot them, it does the exact same thing. Which, also, a very cool detail. Just whenever I remember it. Whenever you ADS, it shows the Gatling gun kind of come up, coming up next to his head. Which, you can see on this as well. So, very cool. But yeah, let's go take a look at his uh, Iron Patriot style. Let's go. So, here we have Iron Patriot in all of his glory, which... He is a red, white, and blue version of War Machine, which honestly, I have to say, the color scheme on him actually looks really, really good. Um, comparing to like the just black and silver the normal War Machine is, like, I obviously really, really like that, but usually the secondary color schemes are just a bit crap, but like, in comparison to those bit crap, you know, bit shit ones, these, this one's pretty, pretty good. So if you take a look up close, you can see they got the silver faceplate with like the blue rest of the helmet with the red stripes. For the torso, got like mainly the blue armor going there with the red arc reactor in the middle. Um, you know, obviously the main color is blue here with like the red accents and the slightly smaller silver accents to break everything up. The missile pods done in blue with like the red missiles on it. His Gatling gun turret thing. Um, is blue with the little red accents on it there. The back bling is also just blue with red fins and the uh, silver in the middle there, which doesn't look half bad. Then for the pickaxe, again, I'm not a fan of it, but it is what it is. There's no like cool swooshing animation around. It. Well, I think there's a tiny bit of a like trail from the fins, but you can't really tell. It's just got the same red like thruster coming out the bottom of it so it's nothing terribly special but yeah definitely not what i use for the skin um but it is what it is so yeah um he has no emote or anything to show off unfortunately and i'm not showing off the gun wrap again because well it doesn't fit with this skin or the style um the only thing i can really show off is how his glider looks just for the sake of doing so while we're here. Which, I usually do this in separate parts or whatever, but you can see how it looks. It's not too bad. Like, it gives me like a G1 Starscream vibe. Um, just with like the the silver with like the blue accents and the red accents. It's very, very nice. It fits well with the skin. So, yeah. Um, that is going to be it though for this video. If you like it, hit the like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys know when I go live and when I upload all that good stuff. And yeah, I really do hope you have enjoyed. Let me know in the comments. And I will see you guys soon with something else whenever I get landed. Yeah. I shall see you guys soon with something else. Goodbye.